Hi, and welcome to Industrial Audio Software's ePodcast series. In the first screen, you will be given three choices. Record a new podcast, open an existing podcast, or create podcast from existing audio file. Let's select Record a new podcast. This is the recording interface, where you will record your podcast. Click File, New. Keep the default settings and click Next. Click on Browse to load music and sound effects files for your podcast. Select the files you want to use for your podcast and click Add. You can rename a file if its name is too long to fit on the button at the bottom of the screen. This is the microphone level indicator. You can set the volume at which you record your voice by moving these sliders. Speak into your microphone and observe the two columns of lights. The two small rectangles at the tops of the columns will light up if the volume is too loud. Let's start recording now. Click Voice and Music to start recording. Press the F key on your keyboard associated with the music file you want to play. Or you can use your mouse to click the corresponding button on the screen. Slide the master mix slider downward and let the music play. Now, take the master mix slider back up towards the top. Begin speaking. When you are finished recording, click the Stop Record button. You can now play back the voice track, the music track, or the mix of the two. Now let's take a look at what the editor can do. You can edit the voice track, the music track, and the mix track. Under Edit Track, click on Voice. The ePodcast editor will come up with your voice track already loaded. Click on Effects to see the wide range of things you can do. You can modify or enhance your podcast by amplifying soft sections, using equalization, removing noises or silence, and adding reverb and echo effects, among many other fun and useful tools. When you are finished editing, save your changes and exit the editor. Now save your podcast by clicking File Save in the record screen.
It's time to upload by clicking Upload Podcast. Uploading is handled by ePodcast Express, the ePodcast series easy way of doing everything from creating ID3 tags to accompany your podcast to making your RSS feed. All you have to do is fill in the blanks according to the instructions on the right hand side of each screen. Select your host and click OK. You may also create a new host. Enter feed information such as feed name, feed title, and feed description. These fields are all mandatory for uploading your podcast. For more details on our many great features, including voice over IP recorder, our customizable teleprompter, and voice effects, see the help file or visit industrialaudiosoftware.com and take a look at our written tutorials.